Now you can't really go anywhere now about without hearing about rosé, especially when it is summertime. It's been made into candy, slushies, you can even get a rosé pool float apparently. Yeah, that's the thing. And tomorrow is National Rosé Day, so we are getting you prepared just in time for the big day. And here to tell us about Northwest Rosé and what they pair with it, we have Elizabeth Powell from King Tide Fish and Shell. So of course you got fish and shell. And then you have the wine. Why do you think rosé has become such a, a thing these days? Is it just because it looks pretty on Instagram or something? Well, so it's got a little more depth, a little more complexity than Ooh. a white wine would have. Okay. So say if you're like really into Pinot Gris, something like that, you just kind of want to dig a little deeper. Don't want to necessarily go into those heavy red wines, especially this time of year, especially with something like a oyster. Rosé is perfect. It's got okay. a nice, uh, nice flavor profile. So what wines did you bring us today? And we'll bring in our wonderful taste testers. We've got Matthew and Al. <laughs> Are you guys rosé fans? Absolutely. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Or brosé, right? Brosé. Yeah. You guys walk in. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> so we have two We have two that we're featuring. One is actually from Oregon, and one is from Washington State. So we're highlighting our Pacific Northwest bounty here. Perfect. We have the Ryan Patrick rosé. Uh, this is out of the Columbia Valley. It's basically a Provencal style. So it's a Grenache, Sensol, Mouved, that style. And it is delicious. I'll go ahead and pour a little bit of this for you. And with some of these, you're giving, you're doing some specials tomorrow, right? Well, this one is actually going to be the one we offer for seven dollars a glass wow. all day tomorrow okay. until I run out, <laughs> which could be quick. It is Rosé Day. What time like do you it. open? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, we open for what Saturday brunch at eleven, and then we start serving. Oh, I'm sorry, we open for brunch at I. Honestly, don't remember right Look now. it up if you want to yeah, go look for brunch. Get there and get some rosé. <laughs> at King Tide PDX on our Instagram will also be a good way to find out what we're doing special. Perfect. And this is Guild Rosé out of the Willamette. And this is a beautiful, light, crisp rosé that we're really sound excited. Sound. It's so Gosh. beautiful. That one's like even lighter color. Well, Very this, yeah, and this one's got a little less. So how they get their color is maceration. So the longer the uh, wine stays on the skin of the grape, it draws color out of the skin. Wow. And that's where you get that flavor, that's where you get the color, and that's how you're getting that like, really beautiful rosé notes that you're getting out of these wines right here. Producer Christian mm. is in my ear saying she confirmed 11 a.m. is when your brunch starts. Yes, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> <laughs> All the research. Now, this does tie in with oysters, right? Is that what you pair best yeah. with rosé? Yeah, uh, well, uh, actually, in my opinion, the patio pairs best with rosé. Oh, <laughs> so good call. If you, if you do patio, rosé is the way to go. <laughs> If you do the bar, rosé is the way to go. And you but, do hot sauce with oysters? So Chef Laura Romero, um, our executive chef, actually does a house-made smoked hot sauce. Wow. But where most hot sauces are really like a lot about heat and not so much about that really rich, intense flavor, he's pulled a lot of flavor out of the chilies that he uses in this. Absolutely. <laughs> so these are Pacific oysters, uh, which are also Miyagi uh, oysters. Oh, God. And they I feel are. Feel like all of a sudden it's just going to come out <laughs> like a whole shot of, of hot sauce. Okay. And they are farmed out of Taylor shellfish. Okay. okay, tomorrow, so National Rosé Day. <laughs> Go to King Tide Fish and Gel. How's it, guys? Mm, Wonderful. Loving the rosé. <laughs> mm. Excellent oyster. Had a little kick to it. Very tasty. Thank, Thank you, you guys. Thank you. We'll be right back. Dig in. Here goes Al.